cream rises to the top, doesn't it? And let's face it, this is a ripper van. Yeah, look, definitely. The uh, On The Move grenade is chock full of features. It's got, it has so much inside it and outside it. I mean, you look at the tear weight of only, you know, 2,600 and some change, you know, kilos. Mm -hmm. um, it has like a nearly 900 kilo payload. Mm. So, you know, you can throw in a lot of stuff when you want to go, but before then, it is already fully loaded with gear. Mm, but let's talk about storage. You know, you've got your tunnel, and you've got a couple of toolkit spots, and you've definitely got some spots on the A-frame, but it doesn't stop there on the grenade, does it? No, absolutely, Tim. On this uh, van, you've also got a rooftop steel roof rack yep. with a ladder to get yourself up there, and you can lash down your swag or whatever you want to put up there really easily. Again, it doesn't stop there, does it? Because let's face it, the actual features on this van, as an off-roading van, are second to none. Yeah, look, you've got things like air suspension, which is, well, for a start, it's independent suspension. Mm -hmm. So, you know, the ride is a lot better to begin with. Yep. Then you've got the air springs as well. So you can adjust the height. Uh, you can adjust the height from side to side if you're on an unlevel um, ground for the site, for instance, you're on. Yep. Um, and also off-road, you know, you can lift it up if you want it to have more clearance, for example. So You bet. Yeah, it's fantastic. You know, there are other features on the outside of this van that I must talk about. Okay, too. Yeah, very exciting. Okay. One is you've got this outside barbecue. Mm -hmm. Now, it, it's sort of similar to you might see on a, a camper trailer. You know, slide-out barbecue, but with a difference. It has an electric rotisserie as well. Okay. It's just nice little touches like that. You know, yeah, yeah. love that. And the other thing is, you know, when you're looking at drop-down legs, you know, it's all very well to say, yeah, you've got the simple drop-down legs, but then you've got to adjust them to yeah. the height of them so they're actually yeah. on the ground. Yeah. What I like about this fantastic setup is it's actually all remote control. I thought that electric. was your phone. <laughs> no, this is this amazing device. Once you've dropped sorry. the legs down sorry, Dan. and you want to adjust the height so they're actually hitting the ground, mm. you just press that. Oh my god! And away they go. Maxi, Timbo. A few times in uh, my career, I look at something and I really, really, really am speechless because this is a very, very beautiful van. And I like the fact that straight away, all the cupboard surfaces haven't got latches on them. And yet you think to yourself, oh, they're, but they're all locked down. Yeah. It's, Beautiful. It's elegant, it's tidy. I'm glad you've opened up this cupboard, mate, and I'll tell okay. you why. There's a nifty device in there. It's a Fusion iPod dock. Okay. So if I can reach over, mate. You sure can. You open that, wow. you pop your iPod in there, and away you go. Man. Favorite change on the road. How about that? It's amazing. And this van is just so intelligently built. I love the lighting in behind the cupboards. It's fantastic. Gives you a usable light. And again, it's going to be that really low power. And speaking of power, this van is fitted with an almost gobsmacking 600 plus mm -hmm. watts of solar capacity. Oh, Mate, okay. Go up to the roof, take the ladder that Phil was talking about yes, earlier. Yes, yes. And the entire roof, just about, is just one big solar panel. Okay. It's four different panels, but I mean, it, it's covering the, the whole the, roof. Just about the, the entire surface area of the roof. Now, that's that's feeding into uh, 200 amp hour AGM glass mat uh, batteries, mate. This is good okay. gear. Mate, you, you can go bush and you can leave your lights on. Put it that way. <laughs> okay. All right? Okay. So, okay. Okay. And you can even run your radio at the same time. Okay, okay. And you know, another feature that I really like there's also a grey water tank. Okay, oh, okay. and now this is something that we're starting to see more and more in the caravan trade. So okay. when you go to a national park, a lot of the regulations are now that you have to have a grey water tank or you yeah. just can't camp there. All okay, right. so grey water tank, you've got your grey water sorted, you can leave no trace. Hey, there's something else. Look, this is this is something more for, can I say, the fairer sex? You bet. Okay, but on the move, they're fitted these recessed um, shoe holders either side of the bed. No. You know me, I'll just chuck my smelly old thongs anywhere. Yeah. But some people, would really appreciate that. Mate, it's just a ripper. And one of the joys of this van is you can lie on your back, open the sky roof, and look, and look at the stars. This is just the best. How good is it? Oh, mate. Mm -hmm.